It's the third homicide this month in Dodge County, and with the rising summer temperatures, officials fear violent crime is on the rise too. 41 NBC's Jasmine Williams joins us in the studio. She was in Dodge County this afternoon, and she spoke with authorities. A body discovered on Cook Road yesterday makes homicide investigation number three involving Dodge County, and their numbers are up from last year. Authorities worry the hot temperatures will flare hot tempers and increase crime. The summer sun and rising temperatures seem to be a boiling recipe for a deadly summer in Dodge County. Greg Giddens was found dead in his apartment at Page Street and 6th Avenue last month. Victoria Mills and her family live next door. It's just terrifying to know that you can't even leave your house. As summer crept on the calendar, crime continued to move in Eastman. A few weeks after Giddens' murder, Jimmy Gay, a local painter, was found dead behind a dumpster on Harry Hargrove Road. On Monday, another body was discovered just miles away. The increased crime has Mills holding her loved ones a little closer. There's no telling how much more crime we'll see before the summer's over with. And statistically, local law enforcement agrees with her. July was the busiest month. Every summer, the Dodge yeah. County Sheriff's Office sees an increase in juvenile and violent crimes. And this year doesn't seem to be any different. The deputies are investigating two murders and a slew of robberies and other crimes. Cooking out, hanging out a whole, you know, a lot more. And so therefore you have more people together. And then when you put those personalities together, they, uh, the violent crimes happen. With the increased heat and more kids on the street, additional deputies are patrolling on the weekends. They're bored and they are subject to entertain themselves by getting with their friends and going and doing this stuff. For Mills and Little Christian, they plan to seek relief from the heat and the crime by spending some of their long summer days inside. Authorities are working to identify the body found near Cook Road in Dodge County. Todd Lowry with the GBI office in Eastman said the crime happened in Bleckley County and officials there are investigating. They do have one suspect in custody and another suspect is being caught. In the Giddens and Gay case, one suspect is in custody and authorities are still searching for Nathaniel Cummings, who was wanted for both murder and armed robbery in both of those cases. Anyone with information is urged to contact the GBI office in Eastman at 478-374-6988.